Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This is Aishram Malyala. In this particular video, I am going to give you the analysis, overall analysis of JE main session 1 so that it will be helpful for your session 2. As well as the analysis, I will also going to give you some preparation tips which you can utilize to your JE mains and increase your score at least by 50 to 60 marks. So what are you guys waiting for? Don't skip the video till the end and also do share this video to all your friends who are going to write JE mains session 2. But before that, as I promised in the community post, I said that a big surprise is going to come on your way. That is not other than our application is launched on Play Store. So if is there is an iOS user, you can use it on the web platform. It is not available on the App Store. And the name of the application is Entrance Corner. I really need your support in this particular thing. Just download the app, try to check all the things available on the app and you can give you a valuable uh, review on the play store the thing is uh, why i created uh, this particular app so the reason being like uh, if you see uh, outside there uh, there are a lot of free contents and there are some paid contents paid contents are like at a high level so so if you want to learn a particular course you have to buy the whole course keeping all these things in the mind so what we thought is we have gathered all the online organizations throughout across india with best faculty best, best teachers and they created some best courses which for different Different exams, Comet K, JE Mains, MSET, um, BITSAT, and uh, SRMJ, VIT, all entrance exams will be covered there in this particular application. So, in the, here you will be having the courses ranging from rupees 1 to 1000, 12,000, 13,000, 14,000. So, you just you can just download the app and check it. And the thing is, so you will also get uh, the courses and uh, study material and you will also get a test series so all these things will be there along with you can check your performance report every day also so you can just download the app using the links in the description and just go to the app if you want to buy any course i am giving a flat 10 percent discount if you buy any course on the application so you can use the code charan 10 on the application before you buy something so just go through the courses available on the uh, application soon some more courses will also be added on that application and uh, you can find this application both on play store and web platform so now just uh, let me talk about JEM and second attempt 2022 july attempt mainly many students are asking me related to this particular video so finally the video is here now it's in your hands to share this video across all the social media platforms and all your groups uh, i was just uh, going through the different uh, instagram posts the other day by the way how many of you following me on instagram if you didn't just follow using the link in the description then i have seen this particular thing failure will hurt but not taking a chance will hurt you more of course if you fail it will surely hurt you but the thing is once after failing in a thing if you don't take one more chance it will hurt you more so it, it has a very deep meaning so those who are like messaging me and even I kept a community post where many people said that they are scoring less than 60 marks for all those people okay no problem like failures are stepping stones of success so those who got very less score and JE means uh, 2022 first session after checking the score so don't think that yeah my expertise nahi, I'm out mera expertise nahi hai. I'm out if you think like that so like you are not a not going to win in anything so why you can't score that's what you need to think so try to take one more chance one more chance in the sense you have the second attempt you have, you have almost like 15 to 20 days it's a golden opportunity for all of you guys use this time properly you will surely get the success so that's what the meaning of this thing failure will hurt but not taking a chance will hurt you more so first thing like uh, let me just give you the overall session analysis so mathematics was moderate to tough and uh, its paper was really lengthy in terms of calculations and uh, physics is like easy to moderate and chemistry is like easy to moderate so don't think the same uh, will happen in the session too so that's what I'm going to say attention viewers last year second attempt was totally different from first attempt so paper level was totally changed I mean see this year also it may happen or may not be happen as first attempt it is not like in the first attempt physics and chemistry was easy to moderate the same you can't expect here for sure chemistry will be for easy because uh, organic questions you can directly solve if you are good at NCRT and organic and inorganic mainly and uh, of course physical though you need to work on that is where uh, majority numerical questions being asked so you should keep that thing in your mind so focus on all the usual important topics so usually we will have some um, more important more weightage more moderate weightage and less weightage topics right try to cover according to that only because 
there is a chance of like asking the questions for example if they focused on one chapter in this particular session if they missed out something from those to first two uh, more weightage and moderate weightage so if they miss something try to focus more on them because they may ask some questions from there also now the thing is uh, when it comes to july attempt what i'm expecting is chemistry will be easy and uh, physics will be like kind of moderate to tough it can be so uh, easy to moderate like this is like this time it's like everyone you it was a lucky moment for all of you guys and uh, maths will be as it is like moderate but again the lengthy uh, calculations are going to come so in order to keep yourself uh, good at calculations you should practice 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 as many as questions you can so that then your calculations become faster so that is where you need to focus on coming to mathematics so difficulty level was like moderate to tough and uh, lengthy calculations as you guys all know so these are the topics which they focus the most coefficients of terms in binomial expansion like usually they will give you one expression from that they will say that uh, what is the uh, coefficient of 100th term 120th term 1000th term 1090th term so that that's how it's going to be system of linear equations you guys know in your trigonometric uh, domains and ranges king's rule so you know right a to b f of x dx so you can just uh, turn it into a to b f of a plus b minus x dx so you can just turn that king's rule and maxima and minima functions and uh, differential equations mathematical reasoning mean deviations and circles relation between roots and coefficients like you know right sum of roots will be minus b by a so it will be not as simple as that but kind of those questions like as to give a clarity i'm just uh, saying like that reminder divisibility and units digit related problems so these are the problems which you can expect from mathematics if you see that uh, the topic was distribution in mathematics so they asked almost like on an average six questions in algebra nine in calculus Uh, seven in coordinate geometry and vectors and 3d5 so these two are like really important so 7 plus 5 12 questions almost like 50 marks trigonometry three questions and the thing is basically uh, trigonometry can uh, come in any way i mean they can mix with algebra they can mix with all calculus they can mix with coordinate geometry they can mix with vectors so you should be very perfect with the trigonometric formulas majority calculations are really lengthy and uh, maths is a really dry topic guys so regular practice of different questions will make it easy so that's what you need to keep the in the mind so if i talk about physics so difficulty is like easy to moderate so the topics which are focused are carnot engine projectile motion gravity at height and depth maxima and minimum intensities de broglie wavelength and work function and the properties of em waves and em spectrum bridges and equivalent resistance and capacitance so they will be giving uh, different uh, parallel connection series connections they will be asking you to equivalent resistance capacitance and inductance so that that will be really easy you can just uh, solve them dimensions of physical quantity the first unit and uh, capacitance due to electric dielectrics so they will be saying do capacitor plates are kept a dielectric uh, material was there it is taken what is the change in voltage it is kept what is the change in voltage these type of questions and uh, magnetic fields due to the current carrying conductors or elements these are the topics which they focus mostly in june attempt for physics now the thing is uh, the distribution of uh, questions in physics were like topic wise mechanics 8 heat 6 electricity 7 optics 4 waves 2 and uh, modern physics 3 so almost all topics are co- covered equally practice of ncert coaching material is more than enough and in ncert try to solve those uh, solved examples inside the textbook and uh, eg- at the back of each and every chapter you will be having some kind of examples right try to solve them also so that's what you need to do and next comes to uh, chemistry difficulty level was easy uh, so the topics they focus most is like structure of atom biomolecules polymers coordination compound d and f block hydrogen and its importance uh, h2o2 amines p block elements so these are the topics they focused most in the june attempt as i st- said in the start so just see what are all the chapters left over which they didn't focused actually which you thought as important first focus on them first and later on focus on these chapters if you do this way you will surely uh, improve your score or if you are at 150 you will surely cross 200 if you are at 120 you will surely class 180 so it's totally in your hands how you study i mean every time whenever you study have some plan without plan or without any strategy if you study so you will just study that's it you will not progress if in order to get a progress in your score and your percentile you should have some plan you should have some strategy so to achieve it so that's what i'm saying distribution in chemistry will be like physical 10 questions in organic 12 questions and uh, organic is 8 questions so majority of the physical uh, chemistry questions were in the numerical based questions so keep that in the mind and organic 12 questions is like next level easily you can give the answers just like that it will not take more time 
and almost all topics are covered and uh, read ncit and solve ncit examples so that's what i can suggest for chemistry too the things which are going which i am going to talk now will be like really some important points which i feel somehow some students are missed before the preparation for je mains 2022 session 1 so now at least for the next 15 to 20 days until your exam comes do this whatever i say okay chalo first thing ncert is a game changer guys according to the june shift that's what i observed so full for july attend make sure you go through the ncert books of physics and chemistry mainly okay solve the example problems okay do that and revise formulas thoroughly so if you see physics papers almost all majority questions were are formula based so don't miss this opportunity formula based questions in physics is like for sure solve all the june attempt papers i'll try to keep all the june attempt papers in my telegram group you can join the telegram group using the link in the description guys try to solve them without seeing any solutions okay so even though you wrote their exam for example you wrote first shift if i keep the first shift paper in the uh, telegram group download it without seeing the answer without seeing the solution try to solve once again not an issue okay so whichever questions missed whichever questions you didn't got in the exam you can also get here you learn something okay right mock test for sure so along with this solving of june attempt papers as a mock test also solve some mock test other mock test so for example regularly like for weekly two or three you can keep as a mock test so you have another two weeks at least if you have three weeks it's fine two or three weeks in this like at least try to solve six papers so including june attempt papers or excluding june attempt papers it's up to you according to your time so try to do what i'm saying like try to write mock tests try to attempt june papers and see which way of attempting the paper is right for you is getting you, giving you more score so how much time you should give for each and every question how much uh, uh, time you should give for each and every subject so just make a note of all these things and try to implement that in your final exam that will surely fetch you some good score compared to first session and see uh, if there is some uh, lengthy question try to leave it and just go for the next question and mark it as a review and later on come again and solve it if you stay at one place you will miss out time for the short, uh, short or easy questions which you can solve within no time so in the exam you should be very sharp that you should leave the hard questions if you find that that is a hard question just leave it mark it as a review and go for the short questions if you do this you will save time you will score more all these things will be there so majority students don't know all these things and that's how they got very less score so i am saying if you follow all these things what i am saying for sure you will be getting 40 to 50 to 60 marks more than what you scored in the first attempt so i hope you will do just let me know in the comment section whether you are going to do that or not and everyone is just watching the videos once again i am saying please do subscribe and support me for the regular content related to entrance exams for engineering to leave the result whatever score you got in the first attempt leave it aside you have having the second option focus on that in the 15 to 20 days you can improve a lot so just keep that in the mind and prepare yourself you are going to crock it all the best and love you all